Okay, in this video I want to show you how to use user accounts to prevent getting viruses in the first place. So we're going to go to the Start menu, we're going to click on Start, we're going to click on Control Panel, and it's going to say User Accounts and Family Safety. Let's go ahead and click that, and uh, let's find User Accounts, User Accounts and Family Safety, Personalization, Ease of Access. Let's click user accounts, parental controls, user accounts. Add or remove a user account. We'll click that. And we can see that we have our user account that we set up when we set up our computer and we have a guest account. Guest account is turned off, but we're going to go ahead and turn on guest account. So now we have guest account turned on. So now when you safe the web or when you surf the web and you want to do so safely without uh, contracting a virus or anything like that you can use this guest account another thing that you can also do is you can create a new account so let's go ahead and do that let's uh, add or remove user accounts and we're gonna create a new account and we're gonna go surf account doesn't matter what you put in there You've got standard user. A standard user can use most of the software and change system settings that do not affect other users or the security of the computer. If you check administrator, this account will be able to change things on the computer, change passwords, and things of that nature. Uh, a standard account, why a standard account is recommended, you can open that up and read that. The reason being a standard account will more than likely not uh, give you access to things that are going to crash your computer. So if you've got surf account here as a standard user and uh, you may or may not want to apply a password to that, that's up to you. Then uh, now if I close out my computer I'm probably going to close out Camtasia but now I can go in here and I can log out. Let's see under the shutdown tab I can log off or switch user I'm gonna try and switch user but if I lose you in this video you kinda of get the idea then you just switch user to that surfing account and you can surf safely now the beauty about this is if that account gets infected you can log back in using your administrator login account and simply delete that account completely and then you don't have to worry about your computer catching viruses on that. So I'm going to try this and see if it works. If it doesn't work uh, for me and my Camtasia uh, recording software doesn't stay on, just rest assured that this works if I have posted the video. And please, if this has helped you, comment, rate, subscribe, and thumbs up are always nice. So let me try this switch user, and if it doesn't work, I will catch you in the next video. Okay, actually that worked and it worked brilliantly because it stopped recording and now I have to edit this to say that it's not recording uh, or whatever. So anyway, yeah, that's how you build a user account and once you've built that user account, all you have to do is go in here to log off and switch user and move over to that user and that user will no longer affect your main account. So if that user and you are that user if you go in under that account you can safely surf the web you can uh, download links do whatever and no matter how much catastrophic crap you result uh, you catch all you have to do is just delete that account and build another user account so this is the best way that I know to prevent viruses to begin with uh, especially if you're going to surf links that come in your email things that of that nature and you're good to go so yeah build uh, additional accounts and always surf the web under those additional accounts never surf the web under your administrator account unless you're going to a website that you're going to download software and you already know that website and that software are safe so thank you very much and safe surfing and we will catch you in the next video